guys, uh, we just visited the German Museum here in the background. Uh, and yeah, it was quite nice, but we, we came as always a bit uh, late, like midday, and uh, it's closing 5 in the afternoon. So we did not even manage to, to visit all places. So if you are planning to go here, for once you should really take them serious what they say about transportation. You should go with public transportation because if you are going with the car to here, um, parking alone is much more expensive than uh, the, the public transportation could ever cost under what circumstances, whatever. So um, this museum is mostly about technology, um, engineering, mining technology, really, really among everything, uh, engineering and technology wise, uh, a big shipping department. They have, um, they have, they have actually their planes and cars they have uh, stored outside in other locations. And yeah, Yesterday we had been there five hours and we couldn't see everything and we walked through it fast. So if you really want to see some stuff, you, you really have to go early. Uh, it's, uh, price is 11 euros for an adult. Don't know the children prices below six years. You don't have to pay. There are many experiments which the children can do and many stuff you can't touch. So it was quite interesting for the kids as well. Um, let's say technology, information technology everything engineering if you don't if you're not into any of this stuff uh, it's probably really really boring um they have astro astrology 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 yeah everything from physics mathematics um yeah mach machining boats airplanes yeah about everything. Uh, also, another thing: if you're going with a with a baby trolley, or if you are in a in a wheelchair, it's probably not the best place to go because they have elevators, but they, some of them are quite small, and you really have to wait extremely long. So, it's much better to go with the stairs. Also, we we went to the whole uh, mining section, which is quite interesting because they about built like an official mine in there did not take so much footage inside um, because it was so stressed to get to see everything and we didn't manage to see everything we only saw about I think two thirds or something a bit more than the half of the, the museum we, all, we managed to see and we didn't stop and read stuff so if you're really into some sections of the museum it's probably a thing where you have to go several times to get get it all in yeah uh, it's like use the use the public transportation to go here certainly a good idea bring bring your own food um, the restaurant is up there but it's not quite good and uh, really expensive so um, not not that expensive but uh, for what you get it's expensive so I, I would rather recommend that you bring your own food um, you will be much more happy with that 11 euros there's a combination ticket with the others the other locations in Schleisheim they have um, the Flugwerft where they have historic planes and um, I don't know where somewhere in the city they have the um, they have the transportation module where they probably have trains, but they they're both only six euros for adults, so much cheaper than the museum itself. short addition to the museum. I think for 52 euros you can become a member of the museum which allows you to enter the whole year and also you can bring another person and your kids uh, or two other kids. So if you are from Munich or living in Munich or planning to go there like three times with your family um, it's maybe worth to invest the extra money and have a yearly membership.